Rock singer Elton John performing before a sold-out house at the Blazing Arena at this hour. And city officials say they're working to bring in more big acts like this one to replace the canceled concert from the bankrupt Honolulu Symphony. KITV 4's Kiyoki Kerr is live with more. Kiyoki? Well, Pam, without the symphony performing this year, the city could lose as much as $165,000 in revenue. So they're working to replace some symphony concert dates with other concerts like Elton John's tonight. More than 7,000 people packed the Blaisdell Arena tonight to see Elton John, a sold-out crowd, for his first concert here in nine years. Folks came from the mainland and all over the state to see the concert. People like these two friends from Maui. One night, girls' night. Flew over this afternoon and going to fly back tomorrow. Thank you so much. It's great to be back here in Honolulu. Everybody's happy at a sold-out concert. The fans, the vendors, who have plenty of business, and the city, which makes money by renting its facilities. City officials are scrambling to try to replace at least 20 performance dates that the Honolulu Symphony has canceled at the 2100-seat Blaisdell Concert Hall next door because the symphony filed for bankruptcy reorganization. City Enterprise Services Director Sid Quintal says he hopes to announce some replacement acts for canceled symphony dates in April, May, and June. We should be hearing within this month of a few that are going to be announced we can go to contract with to open up those dates after March. Promoter Tom Moffat says some acts are interested in coming, but there's nothing definite yet. We've been talking about uh, trying to fill the dates that are available now in the concert hall, so we're working real hard trying to bring some, some star attractions in. It's a tremendous venue, so I think the city does have a great opportunity to work with our local promoters, maybe put some feelers out to uh, promoters from other parts of the country. Fans of Elton John have some ideas about who they'd like to see here next. The Moody Blues, Sir Paul McCartney, Oh, gee, who else would I... I'd come to see Yes again. And um, anything along the lines of Phantom of the Opera. But for tonight, they just sat back and enjoyed the sounds of Sir Elton. Now, Elton John has a second concert at the Blaisdell Arena this Saturday, for which some tickets are still available. Pam? Kiyoki, did you see any celebrities in the audience tonight? Well, actually, while we were waiting backstage, we saw 70s and 80s rock star Ozzy Osbourne, his wife Sharon, and two kids who have become famous to an entirely new generation through their reality TV show. We also saw the lead guitarist from the heavy metal band Metallica back there as well. Pam. Kirk Hammett, right? Yes, he was there, and uh, so was one of the leading performers from the rock band Toto. So it took me back to my junior high and high school days and... Even beyond that, I mean, Elton John's been around for 40 years. You know what would be a great concert? Elton John with the Honolulu Symphony. Would you pay to see that? Oh, most definitely. I think a lot of folks would be, and, uh, and, 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 and the symphony would love it, too. They could, they could use the financial boost.